Jason Hunter here, here with today's Nutrition Quickie. For those of you that don't know what the Nutrition Quickie is or who I am, I'm a registered dietitian. I've been one for almost 18 years now. I focus on helping individuals lose weight, live a healthier life through good eating practices, uh, helping teach people to discover ways to actually eat a lot of food and eat carbs, yet still shed a lot of weight. There's a simple but strategic trick to that. So. Um, I, I work with a lot of individuals on teaching them how to still enjoy all those foods but lose the weight they want. And the Nutrition Quickie is just a quick three to five minute video that gives you a quick tip that you can apply to your lifestyle, your eating plans, your goals. And as you add up these different Nutrition Quickie tips, you know, you're going to have dozens of them to where you're going to realize that you're your habits are, have been transformed and without even realizing them. You know, and it's just these little tiny, quick, simple tips that you just implement into your lifestyle each and every day. And before you know it, you've completely changed your lifestyle for the better. So try to give these just a little try here. You know, don't try to do them all at once, but just add a tip here and there every day Add a different tip. And before you know it, you're going to have a completely transformed lifestyle. So let's get started with today's Nutrition Quickie. And it's a good one. And it was actually brought up to me by a friend of mine and he lost a lot of weight, did really good, he was very strict. We even went on a ski trip one time and he didn't have any alcohol while we were there. He ate clean the whole time and he shed a lot of weight. Looked great. Well, he started gaining a little bit of a back. So I got on him uh, last weekend about it and apparently his mom has been doing the same thing and if he's watching this he's gonna obviously know who I'm talking about so I don't have to give his name here. but. He kept blaming the beer and you know that happens this time of the year you are out you're at pools you're on the boats you're at the lakes you know doing different things barbecues and you know those cold beers taste real good or those drinks taste great in the summer and before you know it you start adding a few extra calories right the weight starts coming on and so he kept blaming the beer and of course my response was so do something about it, right? It's That's just an excuse. There's many of things you can do to con uh, counteract that calories from those beers. It's not saying that you can't ever have a cold beer or a cold alcoholic beverage like that on a nice summer day, but do something to counteract those calories. So walk a little more, spend 10 more minutes in the gym, lift a few more weights, you know, run a half a mile more, you know, do things that are gonna help you burn off those calories maybe go a little less on the carbohydrates during the day or try to make one meal, no carbs, things like that, you know, do some carb cycling. There's plenty of little things you can do to counteract that beer on the weekends, right? And obviously for those that even drink during the week, you may just have to keep adjusting your calorie intake or your activity level on those days that you have those drinks. So it's a real simple tip. Give it a try. So, you know, don't use that alcoholic beverage as an excuse or the summertime saying that's why I'm gaining weight this summer because it's a real easy fix. Just add in some form of activity that's going to counteract those calories you consume or adjust your food intake just a little so that, again, you're not eating extra calories or consuming extra calories with that alcohol. You're, you're complementing it by cutting back elsewhere or eating maybe a little more, you know, a little less carbs or do some carb cycling. So hope you like this tip and, you know, let's get through the summer still looking great in our bathing suits and not give back everything we've worked so hard to gain, you know, to get ready for summer, right? You know, this, this shouldn't be an excuse. So try these different tips like this and you'll find that at the end of the summer you still look great. You didn't put on any extra weight and you got to enjoy that cold beverage at the lake, at the pool or at your friend's barbecue or whatever. So if you like this, give it a like or a share for me. Let me know what you think of this tip. If you have any ideas for tips or things that you've done that worked for you, why don't you leave them in the comments for me or just send me a message and I'll add it to the Nutrition Quickie Tips. And I'll even give you a plug on one of these um, if I use your tip in one of the next Nutrition Quickies. Again, this is Registered Dietitian Jason Hunter. Have a good day.